Day four of the Aegon Championships and once again, all eyes were on Andy Murray. The Briton is bidding for a fourth title at the Queen's Club this week and if successful, will join the elite group of players to have won a quartet of titles here. John McEnroe, Boris Becker, Andy Roddick and Leighton Hewitt. The last time Murray was victorious at the Queen's Club, he went on to lift the Wimbledon crown three weeks later. So no doubt the 28-year-old is once again targeting the title here this week. Tails, Andy. His second round obstacle sorry, was Spain's sorry. Fernando Vadasco, a player with decent grass court pedigree. Okay. Murray was the quickest out of the blocks, clinching an immediate break of the Vadasco serve. Clear Vadasco wasn't going to let the Scotsman have things all his own way. <sighs> Wonderful piece of skill. A second break was enough, though, to put Murray a set to the good. And Murray takes the first. 44 minutes of play on centre court. He broke early. Eventually, Vadasco picked his way back five. into the set. Murray takes it ultimately. Vadasco kept his foothold in the match in the second set. But again, his concentration faltered while serving to stay in it, and Murray seized the moment. It was a bit of a struggle in the second set. It wasn't a fluent match from Murray's perspective. He managed to do just enough to get it done in straight sets. There's work to be done. He's doing just enough to maintain an interest in the event. Top seed safely through in straight sets, seven five, six. Three. Murray wasn't the only star in action on Thursday. Defending champion Grigor Dimitrov was also Third. bidding for a quarter final berth. His opponent Jules match. Miller had other ideas though. The man from Luxembourg came out firing. Oh, what a superb volley that was. A little help from the court as well. But nice and low and skidded away from Dimitrov. And the combination of a strong Miller serving performance and some loose Dimitrov errors was enough for the set to go the way of the 32-year-old. Yeah, in, in his first match this week, it let him down on big points. And it's done so again here this afternoon. Nice little bonus that for Muller. The Bulgarian regrouped to take the second set to a tie-break. Yeah, tie-break yeah. to the side, the second set, and potentially the match. But again, unforced errors cost him dear. Yeah, a slip for Dimitrov, and Muller takes the win. The champion of 2014 is out of the Aegon Championships in 2015. Courtesy of a straight set win for Gilles Muller of Luxembourg. Also bowing out of the tournament on Thursday was last year's beaten finalist Feliciano Lopez. He lost out to fellow big server John Isner in three nail biting tie break sets. Isner's won the match. Two hours and 18 minutes. Fine margins between these two. Just a couple of points either way. But in the end, it is this match. Completing the trio of upsets on Thursday was US Open champion Marin Cilic. He was beaten in three oh. sets by yeah, informed so Viktor Trotsky. Trotsky now taking up his place in the quarterfinal lineup.